named Naomi was a widow. This means her husband had died. She had two daughter-in-laws who were also widows. This means that Naomi's two sons had also died. Can you imagine? How awful, right? Naomi lives in a land far, far away from her home in Israel. Naomi was so sad and homesick that one day she told Ruth and Orpah she was going to go home. Ruth and Orpah were her daughters-in-law. She told Ruth and Orpah to go back to their families. Orpah said, see ya, wouldn't want to be ya. And Ruth said, hey, you can't get rid of me that easy. So off Naomi and Ruth went, home. When they get there, they don't have jobs, but they still have to eat, right? So Ruth goes to work in the grain fields and they have enough food to eat. It's there that she meets Boaz, who marries her and rescues both her and her mother-in-law from a life of poverty. Ruth and Naomi were poor outcasts. In the time in which they lived, women were not treated very well. They had no hope, no future. They had to scratch to survive. Yet through Ruth's bloodline, Jesus Christ was born. Through their story, we learn that God uses the most unlikely people. Ruth and Naomi remind us that no matter what happened in the past, and no matter how crazy our present life may seem, and no matter how dim the future looks, God can use you. 1 Corinthians 1, 27 says, But God chose what is foolish in the world to shame the wise. God chose what is weak in the world to shame the strong. Do you feel like you're not very smart or that you're pretty weak? Well, that's great because that means God chose you. If you've ever been picked last for a team, cheer up because God will pick you first. Why did Naomi not want to send her daughter-in-law away? She didn't want to be ruthless. Before he was married, what kind of man was Boaz? Ruthless. 2020 has been a brutal year. Now it's just ruthless. My girlfriend Ruth fell off the back of my bike and I rode on ruthlessly. A group of girls named Karen, Jane, and Ruth often hang out. What are Karen and Jane like by themselves? Completely ruthless. Ruth wasn't invited to the party. The people at the party were ruthless. Why doesn't Ruth like Joshua? Because Joshua judges Ruth. <laughs>